Did I take a picture? Oh no, it's rolling. It's right there, it's rolling. Hey everybody, it's really Renee here. It's really me, Renee with an A. Coming at ya. First time vlog number one. The very first one. And excuse me if I'm like all up in the camera sometimes or I don't really know where to look. It's a little different. I'm uh, just videoing this on my little Android phone. So, um, giving it a shot. I don't have any little fancy cameras yet or nothing like that. It's a very first time vlog. Let's try it out. I've been a avid YouTube watcher, subscribed to a lot of different channels and things. I thought, hey, I want to give it a try. I want to spread some love out there to everyone with what I have to offer. So just get you some coffee. I got mine. My pumpkin spice coffee. Let's let's have a sip, shall we? Ah, so good. Gives you laugh. Laugh more abundantly. And my dog. The dog busting in on me. Yeah, 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 yeah. Here. Say hello, Roscoe. 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 He's 15 years old. Can't really hear very well anymore. Roscoe. <laughs> Say hello. This is, this is Roscoe. He's my 15-year-old Jack Russell Terrier. Yeah. He just said, oh, well, what's mommy doing in there? I'm busting in. I got to see. I have three dogs. Two Jack Russell Terriers, Roscoe Nene, and then we just rescued Bonnie, who is a Labrador Retriever. A lot bigger than Roscoe back there, who's going to give himself a bath while, while I talk. Yeah, you do that. Okay, so I'm Renee, and uh, on this channel, it'll be all kinds of sorts of different things. Um, I am really love to sing. I'm not going to start with a singing one, but I may do one for the second one. But I love to sing and do different covers, different songs, everything. I don't write my own music or anything like that, but I do love Adele. <sighs> Number one, I love Adele. I love Janis Joplin. I love Motown. I love some bluegrass. I love folk music. There's just, I love rock. I mean, I love all kinds of different music. So I'll be doing some covers of different songs, different things. I love to craft. I'll be making crafts. Uh, I love to do go shopping. That's what I'm gonna start with today. One of my number one favorite things to do is to go to the thrift store. Ah, love thrifting. To get a deal ooh, for nearly nothing. Thrift stores, Dollar Trees, Mighty Dollar, Dollar Trees, Dollar Stores, whatever, what have you. I love doing those. So I'm going to do some of those hauls and do some craft stuff. Who knows? I may film a location one time. I don't know. Whatever just comes our way. Whatever I'm feeling. It's just going to be a plethora. Yeah, it's a plethora. All you Adam the Woo fans. I'm a big Wooian right here. Love Adam the Woo. Even though he's took his break right now. He'll be back. Maybe we'll discuss him one day because I love Adam the Woo. Be yeah, a plethora of uh things we'll be going on right here but right now i'm gonna start with a thrift store haul it's almost kind of like a couple months worth a few things I'll try to make this quick as possible but um this is from like three or four different thrift stores here in north kakalaki yes sirs and ma'ams i am from north carolina and um one of my, I will start with Goodwill. I don't always go to Goodwill anymore. They've kind of gotten a little bit fancy. Do you hear? That's my husband yelling at one of the dogs. That happens sometimes. About the dogs. Yeah. Like get up under your feet. They, you know, dogs, you love them. But sometimes when there's three of them up under your feet. Yeah. You hear that? Get off of my feet, I'm gonna fall. That's all the time. Anywho, 
Goodwill. Yeah, Goodwill's got a little bit fancy on us. They sometimes, their pricing's a little whack and they won't accept certain things, but still love some Goodwill. I always go and look at the wares. Another dog, another dog has come to interrupt. Nene has joined the crew. This is Nene, you see her? This is Nene. This is the other Jack Russell. Yeah, they're like, you are not going to vlog without us being in it. Look at them. This is my life. These right here, she's 12, he's 15. Yeah. Dogs and kids, that's what we say all the time. Dogs and kids. Anyway, I was at Goodwill and in a big bin, I mean a huge bin, they get a lot of stuff from Target. They had all these new things I got for my daughter for Christmas to go in her stockings, stuffers, and um, she just started kindergarten. So there's, she loves num nums and Shopkins and, and they didn't have this stuff when I was young. I mean, I get it, but they didn't have such all these little different types of things. There was three of these and these are all from Target Dollar tree spot or the dollar spot or whatever you call it taller tar <laughs> target dollar spot and so they all were originally a dollar and uh these are shopkins scented stickers okay see right there those two are the same and they got different ones on the back and they just smell like rubber erasers to me. I don't know. Maybe they smell better when you open them up. And these are tattoos. And these were 25 cents a piece. 25 cents a piece. This is Zoom Zooms. Normally $1 at Target Dollar Spot. And these were 25 cents. This is a little num num keychain. It's kind of plush and squishy. It's normally $1. dollar's 25 cents in the bin. This is real cute. A no nums necklace. Normally $1. 25 cents. I saw some of this stuff at the dollar spot at Target and I did not get it because I didn't want to buy, you know, pay a dollar. And look at here, we find it. These are patches. Look at the little lipstick. A little popcorn. They were normally a dollar. I got those for 25 cents a piece. And this little thing was normally a dollar. It is sticky notes and page flags. It says best friends forever. Isn't that cute? It's 25 cent. Now I see these in a lot of different people's hauls and um, they're little puffy stickers. These are like little fruits and it says one and a melon. Normally a dollar, it's 25 cents. I do love the scrapbook and make cards and certain things too. This is a yellow unicorn thing. She's all about magical unicorns right now. It says, be colorful. That's right, be colorful. I love some color. Love color, you see my room. This was 25 cent. Another num nums thing. It's a little keychain, like rubbery. It was normally a dollar, 25 cent. These little stickers with the rainbows are both the same. They got like, letters and then uh, rainbows and um, unicorns and all kinds of little thingamajiggers inside. They were 25 cents a piece. Great stocking stuffers. There's another little banner. This was normally $3 and it was half off. It was $1.50. This is one in a melon. You're one in a melon. Isn't that funny? Cute. This little Shopkins water bottle thing. It's got all the little Shopkins family hamburger fries and soda pop. This was a dollar, I believe. Now these I saw, they were really cute at Target when they had them out for like a teacher's gift or something. Very sparkly, glittery. It was normally $3. It was $1.50, I believe. Last but not least for that, this little journal. Isn't it cute with the little gold writing? It just has white pages. Normally $3. It was a dollar. 
totally cool for Goodwill. Okay, moving on to my favorite thrift store ever here, which is called Value Village. Pause. What do you think, Roscoe? Oh, so good. My New York cup. Went to New York last year for the very first time with some friends. And then we went um, this year with my husband to New York. And I got that beautiful cup. And I sang karaoke in New York. And I told everybody, yes, I sang karaoke this summer in New York. Sure did. I, really, I mean, I really did. So much fun. If you've never been, you should go. But next to the store, it was the value village and I love the value village because you can still get stuff for like 40 cents a dollar and they go by the item you know at that store and I found these these are very beautiful they're quilt squares see how big they are very colorful I don't know if they're hand stitched or sewn um on sewing machine I don't really care just love it because it's colorful and then there's this one Looks more fallish if you look close. There are guitars on there. Ain't that cute? Guitar. I love it. So you could use this as placemats or put it on your dining room table or coffee table or where, what have you. Make another quilt. It's your world. It's Bob Ross. It's your world. Wherever you want to put it. You can. Now this I love. Another thing about me. I love miniatures. And I have a dollhouse and lots and lots of miniatures. But this is from Hallmark and I paid $1.99 for it. And it's this little dollhouse. It's a Christmas ornament. Isn't that cute? And inside, there's a little Christmas tree and a dollhouse inside the dollhouse. A little bed, little chair. Really cute. Go on the tree or you could take this part off and put it in your dollhouse. You have a little dollhouse and a little girl's room in the miniature world. Um, also there, I found these now. It's a really sad day. I used to do clowning for many, 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 many years. Um, through church and everything. I used to be on a drama team and me and my husband were drama directors for many years. So I love doing plays. I do um, musicals at Narrowway Productions and I haven't done it this year but I've done it for a couple years before. So I love the acting, the singing and musicals and I love the circus and they're no more. The circus is gone. <laughs> but the stuff remains. The souvenirs. Isn't this the cutest thing? Oh my gosh. It reminds me of my childhood so much. This is like the little cups. They had like the um, rainbow snow cone things in it. We'd be piled up. And this was 60 cents I paid for. This is like Juliet the elephant. I miss the elephants in the circus. Ringling Brothers is no more. And then they had this one. The clown one. To really luck. And this one right here. The icy would have come out of there or whatever. Cute. 60 cents a piece. You know, at the circus, they were trying like $15 for that thing. Got those. And uh, I think that's all from the Value Village. Now, there's another thrift store here in town called the Bargain Hunters. And um, when I was younger, my mom collected these little trinket things called Holly Hobbies. <gasps> yes, they were like, of course, I mean the miniatures. They were a little miniature um, train, a little typewriter, a little water thing. They had all kinds of different little school desk. I have never seen this though. It says right here, Holly Hobby. I paid 99 cents for it right there. And it's this beautiful picture. And it says, start each day in a happy way. That's so good. And it's, I mean, it's big too and heavy. I mean, it's like the size of my face. I could be a Mrs. Potts from Beauty and the Beast. Like, do 
tale as old as time, true as it can be, both a little strange, finding you can change, learning you were wrong, beauty of a beast. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'm gonna love that. That's beautiful. Really cute. And that's Holly Hobby herself. 99 cents. Not sure what it original was. I'm sure it had a lid too, but there wasn't a lid. Um, also found this was in like a little grab bag and it had other toys in it, which my daughter has taken possession of. But it's a little, it's like them. It's like them back there. As they are now sleeping. It's your friends. It's your friends. It's your baby, Nene. It's your baby. Isn't he cute? He's got a little bed. He can take a little nap on. Good night, night. And then if he's feeling a little playful, he has a little rope. Who comes up with this stuff? This little bowl. He can eat. And a little bone. He's got a little bone. And I think the whole bag it had a bunch of toys and different things in it was like two dollars or something I mean it had bunches of stuff but I had no idea that, that was in there that was a plus it's mine. It's mine. also there was another little grab bag this was at the bargain hunters and there were four things in there it was a dollar twenty nine first off this toilet spray I'm not really sure let me put on my, let me put on my specs uh it's real little. Yeah, this is like a toiletry spray. Now, I'm not really sure. Y'all see this little symbol right here? I don't know if this is some kind of occult symbol or some kind of hex. I don't, I, don't, I don't really know. Can somebody tell me what name brand that is? I don't know. It doesn't say. It just has a number. But it smells really good. It's real soft smelling. And it's supposed to be like a toiletry spray, I guess. You spray after you go poop poop, you know, in the bathroom. Um, but this is something I would spray on myself. Not up in the bathroom. I don't know. But it does smell really good. It was 69 cent. Yeah. And, um, but I don't know what this symbol is. If anyone knows, can shed some light. Oh, you don't know? Just, I just now realized that might be an M and a T. I don't know. But I'm not, I'm not really sure, okay? Also, there was this one, and this is Trendy. And then the letters are kind of jumbled. I think it is also a toiletry type spray for the Palto Room. This smells really good, too. Um, this was uh, this was in the bag for $1.29 with these two right here. These are Herbal Essence, and it's Oil Elixir. Oh, my. Intensely conditions with every drop. I need that in my life for my wool with this long wool. I love anything kind of Oregon oil, essential oils, any type of stuff like that. Natural stuff is for me. I love it. And that's a good deal. Both of those in that toiletry spray, the dollar twenty nine. Can't beat that. Now, there's another little thrift store. We're on to the third thrift store right down the street here and it doesn't have a name it doesn't have a name it's just an old thrift store that these people own that's in like an old general store real old kind of have to dig through kind of pickers type and what I found there was this cute Santa I love Christmas time one of my favorite holidays and I love decorating with Santas I have like a whole shelf where I put a bunch of Santas on and he is so cute he's so rotund look at that Look at his butt butt. Oh, little fat poochy butt of a Santa. His little lantern and his clowny like shoes. He was normally five bucks. I got him for a dollar. He's real cute. I like him. Also there. Got this Christmas ornament. Reminds me of my grandma. My grandma loved hootie owls. And he's old and so vintage. I love antique vintage type of things. Um, this was from Hallmark Christmas Trimmer and it just says Merry Christmas. It was 25 cent. Love the retro stuff. This old little angel, I've just realized how her mouth was. She's like, 
kind of creepy, but um, this, she is from 1973. Betty Faratag, I'm not really sure. It says 1973. I did pay $1.50 for her. But this is this old school. Old school little angel. And then, of course, I'm going to find miniature stuff wherever I go. This little Santa, 25 cent. Pretty cute. A little wooden Santa. Um, these necklaces were 25 cents. Aren't they cute? This one's like made from an acorn or a, I don't know, some kind of nature thing outside. 25 cent. Then there's four of these little Santas doing back flips and um, splits and things. I don't even know what he's doing. This one's sitting down. They were 25 cent for all four. This little angel bell was 25 cent. Then these remind me of my grandma also, something she would have. These are strawberry salt pepper shakers. Isn't that cool? They're so cute. Not sure what I'll do with them. Probably put them on a miniature thing. Now this is really, really neat. This is old. Kind of creepy. This is Snow White. Have you ever seen a Snow White like that? My dog's hacking. He does that. Sorry. Snow White. And it says Walt Disney. Right there. I mean, she's really super old. I don't know if she had more color on her. You can see where the black is gone from her head. She was 25 cent. She's probably worth more than that. I've never seen such an old little creepy Snow White. Don't eat the poison apple. Get out of there. Ah. <laughs> now, my daughter and I went to... I'm trying to figure out how to put this went to some yard sales Saturday. This is the last of it. I promise we're going 20 minutes. The first vlog's gonna be long. Wait, let's pause for a brief pumpkin spice coffee commercial. Oh, so good. It gives you a laugh. Laugh more abundantly. Thank you, Jesus. Okay. This, I know Nana will like. My mother-in-law, I love her. She's wonderful peoples. She likes the Beatles. Let it be, let it be. And I think this was 25 cent, pretty sure. It's at the yard sale in um, Aunt Barbara, or Aunt Barbara. She likes UNC Tar Heels. This is a little blingy, little thing you put your drink in to keep it cold. Really cute. It was 25 cent. Can't be that. And then a scarf. I think someone handmade and tied it together and put those on there. Pretty little scarf to put around you, winter, or hang on your chair or what have you. And I believe it was 50 cents. Excuse me. And then this bag as well. Isn't this cool? I mean, I have paid $13, $14 for one before. And this one was $1. One dollar. Really, really good. And at that same yard sale, there were these little jewelry pieces. I love hippie, bohemian tie dyes. You can see. I love all that type of stuff. This was 25 cent. And then this necklace. And it's like a heart. And it's like glass. And it's got like white little swirly. I don't know swirly little thing. Bear with me, I'll figure out how to, I hope the lighting is okay and just see what it looks like. Really cute, nice quality. I don't, the chain's not all that, but I got it for this. I can put it on another chain. And it was 25 cents. Can't find anything for 25 cents anymore. Okay, I believe, oh, how can I forget Ross? Oh, as I kill her. Excuse me. Oh, she's okay. Roz. I almost forgot what her name was. I have glasses. I mean, these are close, but I have glasses just like this. And I looked and looked for them. Can I find them? Next vlog. I will find them. She's going to be our mascot. Raj. She was all like, Mike Bagowski. I'm always watching you, Mike Bagowski. She slithered off.
<laughs> but yeah, there's a picture of me with the glasses on and my skin looked pale. I looked, they said I looked like her. I said, thanks. And if I push my neck a little more. Yeah. It's got her. She was like 50 cent, 25 cent. I don't remember. She was out at a churchyard sale, just sitting there. I was like, Ross, there you are. You gotta come home with me. So, that is my haul. Burr's Thrift Store haul. So, um, yeah, here we are, vlogging. I hope you'd enjoyed it. Since it's my first time, I'll probably say it sometimes, but I know, it usually gets on people's nerves. But just that's how you build your base. That's how you get your people, right? Subscribe. Press the subscribe button and give me a thumbs up. Give me a like if you liked what we did here today, okay? And um, thank you all for being with me. And I hope you sit back and come back for more. Who knows what we'll do tomorrow or the next day, okay? All right, everybody take care and be blessed. See you later. Bye-bye.